Hi, Hi from high. high and welcome back to a new episode. This time we are exploring Madeira's wild side, from beautiful hikes to a heavy storm in the marina. Stay with us for this new adventure. If you are new here, we are Pat and Frankie. We sold everything to start a new life on board our sailing yacht High. Last time we arrived to the beautiful island Madeira after a short sail from Porto Santo. We checked out the marina and its surroundings. One little morning hike. We are excited to see the sunrise and look around. Ooh. Wonderful view. What an amazing landscape. Wow. and like volcanic landscape, blue water. I've been on many hikes but this one is really one of the nicest. It's beautiful. Here comes the mountain goat. <laughs> Let's run for our sunrise. I nearly made it. No aloe vera. They're gone. We learned it's agave and now they're in the dustbin. Bye bye. Welcome to Pat's Kitchen Stories. In this episode, Pat will be sharing some local <laughs> <laughs> recipe with you. And it is called... Olo de caco. A very strange sounding food <laughs> from Madeira. Super nice. Tastes super nice and it is... This is bread and here I prepared some butter with garlic, like two garlic um, pieces. And I squeezed them and later I will mix them but the butter needs to get a bit warmer. And now it's time to cut the bread. Put it on the oven. To heat it up because it's normally it's directly from a stoned barbecue. Um, so it's super nice, but first I need to check if it fits. Oh, it oh. fits perfect! This is the bowl of the caco <laughs> And today I will try a little piece of them with gorgonzola. Oh, wow! Maybe it's nice. Definitely. I think it's very nice. Okay, now let's cut it. What tips would you give on to prepare bolo di caco? Is it best with butter or yeah, what else? Yeah, with butter and, uh, and garlic. But the best tip is take a lot of butter and take a lot of garlic. And there's Frank coming. Okay, are you going to have a look outside? Yes. <laughs> I can mix it with the garlic. Mm. Oh my god. And maybe you can also put a bit of salt in it. A special tip from me. <laughs> a pro tip. And it tastes better if you do it like this. Oh, you can see. Oh. Le salt. Le salt with some flowers. Oh. Okay, hurry up, I'm hungry. Yeah, one second. It already smells amazing. Perfect. Take the plate, put it there, turn it around. Oh. Wow. Amazing. And then you cut it. Show me so, the goodness. One quarter for me, 
One more for me. One more for me. And one is for Frankie. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Mm. Uh, mm. <laughs> That's how we eat, like over there. Mm. Mm -hmm. One plate, then we have less wash to, <laughs> to wash. <laughs> okay, bye. Zoom zoom. Zoom zoom. We got our go car today. <laughs> Yay, I'm Yay. excited. <laughs> and it's a wonderful Fiat Panda. <laughs> I'm excited that we will make make it up the hills. Yeah. We will. Yeah. Welcome to our road trip in Madeira. Ah. We've been excited about it the whole time to rent a car and go explore the island. And now it's time for that! And now it's happening! For now we've done a really nice hike and we've visited one market. And, and one festival. And one, one festival. festival. That was fun and I think we are going to like all the rest of the island. Today we are going to a fairy forest. Yeah, I'm super excited because a lot of people say it's super nice when it's like foggy but Maybe it's foggy today, yeah. let's see. <laughs> I think it's really hard to predict how the weather will be over there, so we're just going to give it a try. Because today it is a little bit wind, no, not a little bit, it's windy. <laughs> windy and sunny over here, but there are some clouds, so maybe we're lucky, and if not, it will be nice anyways. And a lot of the, of the sites are clo were closed the last days because of huge fire or some fires. But the fire workers did a very good job and so there it seems to be open again. I'm also excited if we will see some of the parts where it was burning. Let's see, fingers crossed that we will be successful. And my babe is back at driving. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tunnel number five, I think. In ten minutes. Yeah. Wow. We did not expect this. We were just driving towards the forest, and then we saw all the burned places that were on fire two days ago, and it looks really crazy and bad. Been a big fire. Really not nice. But today it is a little bit raining, so that's good for that. At least. Cow shit. A lot of people told us that we have to be aware of the cows in the street, and this is definitely cow shit. So, <laughs> so enjoy it. Enjoy the snack. What is it? Huh? What is it you have there? It's a croquette. Is it nice? Yeah, it is Let nice. Try. Mm. Nice. Mm -hmm. One more bite. <laughs> One more bite. <laughs> mm. <laughs> That's always like this. Mm -hmm. I take something <laughs> super nice. <laughs> Frankie is taking something mm -hmm. else. <laughs> <laughs> and she really enjoys your choices. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. You just have so good taste. No wonder you're together with me. What is this kind of bolo? It's a bolo de head. <laughs> I think something chicken. with chicken. Frango. You want to do the first No, bite? you do the first bit. Let me know if it's nice. Mm. It has pieces inside. Mm -hmm. That's, That's nice. Good, yeah. Try, but not too much. Here you can see the difference between the green areas and the burnt ones, so it's like really crazy. Wow, it's so sad. And it looks so strange because of the other side of the road. like a jungle here super special look at these old trees
Amazing. Madera jungle. It's a mystical place. Ah! <laughs> What's there? Ah! <laughs> Babe, what are your experiences on our hike so far? A lot of jungle. A lot of jungle, yes. More jungle. <laughs> Some fog. An amazing landscape. Mm -hmm. And... Bye! <laughs> Bye! You. Another stairs. Yeah. Joy! It is crazy. Yo. Thank Take you. Them. That's like And now we are waiting for some stormy days, maybe one or two, and especially a very stormy night. It's predicted that the wind is getting up to almost 60 knots, especially the gusts. And the waves are yeah, between 4 and 6 meters. So let's see how it's going to be here in the marina. The wind is coming from yeah, first from south, southwest, and then it's turning to north, northwest. So we are very excited what is going to happen. So all the storm preparations are done. The fruits are saved inside <laughs> as well as here. Everything is saved inside from outside, from the cockpit and here. We cleaned everything. Put our flag away, our fishing route. We saved the starling again. We have doubled our lines. We saved our dinghy inside the garage in the marina. So it's everything super clean. Frankie is preparing the first coffee for today. Hi. There are some more roads. You can see the wind is coming. Now it's getting darker. There are also waves predicted up to 6 meters. More ropes. More ropes over there. Where everything is yeah, prepared. And we hope it will be fine. You need to see the flags. And he's doing some soft check holds. Which is like uh do you have a fill oh, there's a finish one? It's a connecting piece like a metal shackle but out of a rope or out of dyneema. And it's more it's stronger. 
doesn't make noise, so it's super cool. Well, Pat is making soft shackles. I am making a spätzle with a creamy sauce. And it's gonna be our feel good food because outside it is raining. I need to close the window again soon. And it's a little bit stormy, wet. So we are spending the day inside, which is nice. Sometimes it's not bad. How do you feel? We're having one of the <laughs> uh, most severe storms on Predict Wind car. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel. Tired. I'm a bit tired now. And yeah, until now everything is almost fine. So I hope it stays like that. Hmm. <laughs> and what are you going to check? All the lines and everything is Tricks. still in place. <laughs> Maybe you can also feel again if the clutches are still <laughs> on the board. There. I tried. Earlier today we saw somebody walking with one in the hand. Oh, let's hope. And here is our Madeira flag. It was hopefully the only victim of the storm. It got blown off. We'll put it back tomorrow. So at the moment we have definitely the stormiest night in the marina. It's getting crazy, up to 59 knots on the mooring. We will see what the night brings. And here you can see the swinging bananas. It's crazy. We had a maximum of a little bit over 60 knots tonight or today. The storm has been going on from, I think it was 11 and now it is 10 past 1. Um, the maximum we're having now is 47 knots, so that's still about 80 kilometers per hour. And we are on channel 17 and we will stay there for tonight to be in contact with another boat from Austria. If somebody wants to talk, say something or ask something, we'll be on standby with them. And now we're going to try to have a nap. But the weather is still going strong. You can hear it, you can hear it in the front. And if I could put it on film, what is happening outside with the other boats, that's really crazy. I'm not really concerned that something will happen now because we've been fine for the last hours but I hope the other boats will be fine too and then nothing comes loose or affects us in that way so let's try to sleep and we hope our Portugal flag will survive let's <laughs> hope for the night mm. what is it? Oh, one of mm. my or our favorite dishes. No, 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 no. After a night of salad. Next time we are exploring what Madeira has to offer besides beautiful hikes. Hit subscribe to not miss our next adventure. Thank you for watching. Cheers!